explain a little bit of the work I do in Detroit. Um, I work with an organization called Detroit Summer. Detroit Summer um, is a youth-led um, community organization. We basically nurture youth leadership and activism, um, and we utilize media and hip-hop specifically to do that. Um, the main program that we have is called the Live Arts Media Project, and we call it LAMP for short. LAMP is essentially um, a space for young people in our community to learn how to make their own media, um, specifically around the injustices happening in the education system. So um, one way that racism plays out is definitely in our education system and the um, schools to prison pipeline specifically um, that you know basically tracks young people into the prison industrial complex and um, treats them as criminals from a very young age. And um, one of the things that, that LAMP focuses on is looking at the reason why Detroit has one of the highest dropout rates in the country. And um, our dropout rate is over 50%. I want to say it's closer to 70. Um, they just shut down another quarter of our public schools. They're planning to close in the next um, year. And uh, just in the last couple of years, they closed 90 public schools. And obviously, thousands of jobs went with those as well. And so we're in a crisis. you know. And, and Detroit is an extreme example of what's happening in almost every other city in this country. Um, and so the way that we approach that crisis in Detroit and with Detroit Summer, we say there's an opportunity in the crisis for a new kind of leadership. And that leadership is going to come from the youth who are most impacted by those issues. So what the youth have done, they, um, they learn how to do community interviews. They run around the community. They interviewed other young people um, at street festivals, at community centers, you know, at the park, wherever they could find young people and ask them why them and their friends dropped out of school and get to the root issue of it, not just like, stay in school, kids, even though they treat you like you're an animal when you're there or teach you nothing that's relevant to you, or try to prepare you for a job that no longer exists in your city. You know what I'm saying? It's like, really, what's the real reason that you're dropping out? And so they did these interviews, and they learned how to...